gave me these glasses. He said it would, uh, he's, he said it would make me look smartier. Bernie Sanders. Bernie. President Bernie. You know, I, I feel weird using words like values and morals because those are words that have been co-opted by people who wear them as shrouds to justify terrible things like... like bigotry and greed. I'd like to take those words back tonight and use them to describe Bernie Sanders. Because his moral compass and sense of values inspires me. He, he always seems to be on the right side of history. And uh, it takes a very brave and very empathetic and, and very visionary person to do that. Not only was Bernie fighting for civil rights in the 60s, he was also fighting for gay marriage in the 80s. He was against the Iraq war, against against deregulation of Wall Street that led to the 2008 collapse. And most importantly, against the breakup of Destiny's Child. I may have made that last one up. Where other candidates are getting gigantic sums of money from billionaires in exchange for compromising favors. <laughs> Bernie is not for sale. <laughs> Where the Koch brothers have been pouring hundreds of Is it Coke or Coke? I think it's either way, like Goldstein, Goldstein. They both work. Where the Koch brothers have been pouring hundreds of millions into Republican candidates. For instance, they just gave Ted Cruz $15 million. Like it's nothing. Bernie raised $15 million from 250,000 human people making donations that averaged $35 each. Not from the Koch brothers, not from Goldman Sachs, not from Monsanto. He is a man of the people. He has to be. His name is Bernie. And he's a man for the people. He has to be. He's from Vermont. You know, I have a friend named Tall John. He's very tall. It's a non-ironic nickname. And I always go to him when I'm not sure what the right thing to do is, because he has that kind of compass. And I see that in Bernie. He seems to care solely about what is right, what is best for people. And people are what America is made out of, so it works great. <laughs> he says what he means, and he means what he says, and he is not for sale. You can't buy him, and I just think that is so neat. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I give you if we're all very smart and a little bit lucky, the next president of the United States, Senator Bernie Sanders.